Well, a couple of important news. Uh, uh, first of all, they redefined the definition of hypertension, um, uh, cutting down the old threshold from 140, 90 or, um, to 130, 80. So for the new American guidelines, over 130, 80 is stage one hypertension. They um, uh, they eliminated the de definition of prehypertension uh, um, that was present in the Jane C7 and defined the, the blood pressure between 120 and 129 as um, elevated blood pressure, not hypertension, but elevated. It's a kind of a warning for uh, continuous control. Um, in addition, uh, they set 130 over 80 as the new threshold for uh, treatment, uh, basically for every, almost every conditions. You should decrease blood pressure under 130, 80. Um, probably the new definition of hypertension uh, is also um, uh, a consequence of uh, the evidence that uh, we should uh, actually treat our hypertensive patients uh, going down uh, uh, further than usually we have done uh, until now. But I think that the, 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 there are two different aspects. One is to uh, reach a, a good target control with your uh, hypertensive patients. Another, a completely different story, is to, uh, to increase in some way the prevalence of hypertension giving uh, this lower threshold. The evidence is pretty strong, that, uh, so they can defend uh, this choice. But of course I'm wondering uh, if I should actually consider hypertensive an 80-year-old man with the 135 or over 85 or over 80. So I'm, 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 pretty, I'm not sure that this is the right choice, but of course we will discuss this in Europe for our 2018 European guidelines that will be released next year. Um, the other issue is that uh, we had some difficulty uh, to treat hypertension, uh, uh, pushing people under uh, 140 and over 90. So, of course, I'm wondering uh, how much effort we will make to, to be able to reach the new target of blood pressure control.